want to stop talking about it and do something about it. For the fourth year, dozens of people walked to spread awareness for domestic violence, a crime that knows no boundaries. It's an epidemic that is growing. It, it, and it doesn't know rich or poor, black, white, you know, educational background. It, it affects everybody. The group, Walking in Her Shoes, spreads the word by walking from Greater Johnstown High School to Central Park downtown. This year, the group introduced Walk the Beat, aimed at men in turbulent relationships. Both groups look to help victims and their families. Walking in Her Shoes has actually been out there helping the, the families of victims. They've helped with funeral arrangements. They've helped in any way that they could possibly do so. Cambria County Chief Deputy Coroner Jeffrey Lees was one of the featured speakers, only to tell the crowd three people from the area died from domestic violence this year alone. Many are hopeful events like this will wake others up to what's going on around them. It's more or less like a code of silence, like they're not going to tell, they're going to be a snitch. Um, and it's really not helping anybody because while you're being quiet, while you're silent, these crimes are continuing and these people are still on the street. T-shirts are being sold to help victims and their families. Organizers hope one day to open a safe house in the area. And if we can get them out of that environment, then I think we can help a lot more women.